Hello everybody, I'm Carlos Gontov. Welcome to my channel. <coughs> I get so mad when I cough in the middle of a sentence. What about you? When do you get mad? You see, mad is an adjective. One of the meanings of mad is angry. So we can say, I'm mad, I get mad, or I feel mad. But you know, a word can have different forms. A word can have a noun form, a verb form, an adjective form, an adverb form. Not every word has all the forms. And it's important to know the word forms and to know how to use these forms. Let's watch a scene from the TV show The Fosters. In this program, Jesus is a teenage boy who was adopted by Lena and Steph. In this scene, he just visited his biological mom, Anna, and found out she's pregnant. Now he's telling one of his mothers, Lena, about it. And Lena thinks he should tell the other mom about what happened. Watch the scene and see if you can identify the word mad in its different forms. Do you have to tell mom? Yes, of course I'm going to tell mom. And actually, I think it might be nice if you told her yourself. I can't tell her. You told me. Yeah, because you don't get so mad. That is not true. I just don't show my madness as madly, but I get mad. I am, I am mad. Can't you? No. Come. And when you do tell her, don't mention that you, that you told me. Why? Because it, it'll make her feel good. That Anna's pregnant? No, that you came to her first. Oh, and she won't get mad. I get it. That's a good strategy. So, did you identify the different forms of mad? Let's watch this scene. You don't get so mad. In this sentence, mad is an adjective. And as I said before, you can say, you're mad or you get mad. Let's try to say the sentence with him. You don't get so mad. You don't get so mad. You don't get so mad. Now let's watch another scene. I just don't show my madness as madly. Madness is a noun. So she says, I show my madness. And madly is an adverb. It refers to the verb show. It's the way she shows her madness. So she says, I show my madness madly. Let's say the sentence with her. I just don't show my madness as madly. I just don't show my madness as madly. I just don't show my madness as madly. Let's watch one more scene. But I get mad. I am, I am mad. Here mad is an adjective again. I'm mad or I get mad. Let's say the sentence with her. But I get mad. I am, I am mad. But I get mad. I am, I am mad. But I get mad. I am, I am mad. Now let's watch one more scene. Oh, and she won't get mad. Here mad is an adjective again. She won't be mad or she won't get mad. Let's say the sentence with him. Oh, and she won't get mad. Oh, and she won't get mad. Oh, and she won't get mad. Now let's watch the whole scene again with subtitles. Do you have to tell mom? Yes, of course I'm gonna tell mom. And actually, I think it might be nice if you told her yourself. I can't tell her. You told me. Yeah, because you don't get so mad. That is not true. I just don't show my madness as madly, but I get mad. I am, I am mad. Can't you? No. Come. And when you do tell her, just don't mention that you, that you told me. Why? Because it, it'll make her feel good. That Anna's pregnant? No, that you came to her first. Oh, and she won't get mad. I get it. That's a good strategy. When you watch movies and TV programs in English and you don't understand everything, don't get mad. Reacting madly is just, well, just madness. So relax, keep watching things in English, and with time and practice, you'll understand more and more. Thanks for watching and goodbye!